Hey everybody, I'm Nikki D with Focus on the 615, hanging out here in Dixon, Tennessee for Craig Morgan's 8th Annual Charity Event, getting ready for a celebrity off-road trail ride, and then later tonight we'll be hitting up a concert. Look at this, it's awesome. Let's do this. Raymond's in a Sunday vest. He's usually up to his chest in oil and grease. The red towel made its way to Dixon, Tennessee for this guy's eighth annual charity event. Welcome, Craig Morgan, to the red towel. How's it going? <laughs> Good, thank you. <laughs> what do you think? That's awesome. Believe it or not, we, we're going to need this a lot more uh, in a, about an hour. <laughs> I think so, too. Yeah. I definitely wipe your feet with it or do whatever you want. That's why we're here. Explain what's going on today. This is such a cool charity event. I like it. There's uh, bikes. Our, yeah, it's our eighth annual off-road trail ride uh, and concert to make money, to raise money for Billy's Place, a home that we're supporting. Uh, that's a home that uh, provides uh, shelter for children in the transition between being removed from the home or, or whatever until the time they're placed into either a foster family or, or placed back with the family. Uh, it's a short-term transition home. Um, the objective was to just minimize the trauma on that child as much as we possibly can. So that's that's what we're doing here today and we do it. Everything that we do in this community uh, for our fundraisers is for that cause. Yeah. Well, hey, I love that you're involved in this. You're such a little daredevil and all around outdoorsman. How long have you been riding? Uh, all my life, really. Uh, I took a break when I was in the Army. I didn't get to ride much when I was in the Army. Uh, when I got out of the Army and our kids started riding, I started riding again with them, just really just to follow them around, make sure they didn't get hurt. And, and then they started riding semi-professionally, so I had to get faster to keep up with them. Okay. And then eventually they started passing me, so. <laughs> Hanging out with Fred Andrews, off-road champion. How's it going today? Going really good. How are you doing? I'm doing all right. Welcome to the Red Towel. I think you are the first rider ever to stand on the towel, so that's a first. That's pretty cool. Yeah, when you brought the towel over, I wasn't quite sure if you're going to wipe my face off of what we're <laughs> doing, but yeah, it's different. Well, maybe later. I don't know if you want to do that after standing on it. I'm sure it's going to get pretty dirty. Well, after riding out there today with all the dust and the mud, that towel's going to be the cleanest thing, so I won't well, even bother me at all. There you go. <laughs> Talk about being a part of this event today. It's not your first go around with Craig's. Yeah, no, I've been here since the very first time, and it's grown every year, and it's fun. You know, we raise money for a good cause, and we meet a lot of nice people. You know, some people never get to hang out and do things like this, so yeah. it really happens, and it's fun. You get to throw mud on each other and have fun. Yeah, and it's cool that people get to ride with you guys. You know, like, you guys are heroes for some of these kids, and, you know, some people in general just out there. Yeah, you know, that's part of the good part of it you know some people never would never get a chance to ride with us and here we ride on the trail we actually encourage guys to say hey let's go for a ride we go with them if they fall down we pick them back yeah. up or they pick us up one of the two the red towel has followed you back here to the outdoor <laughs> concert dude how did everything go today unbelievable i think we only had one injury a lot of scratches, but that happens in the woods. That's not a big deal. But uh, I think we had one person twisted their ankle a little bit. But uh, so I'm excited that nobody got too severely hurt. Uh, and if you've seen those guys, I don't know if you've seen them do the big jump over the rock and over the tree. So uh, once we got out of that, I was happy. How is your shoulder doing? Good. It's holding, right? holding up really well, yeah. Okay. I got the best doctor in the world. I got to give him some props. Uh, Elrod in uh, Nashville it must be the best guy in the world because it's only eight weeks old and I rode all day today. <laughs> really? Oh my gosh, you are crazy man, absolutely crazy. Well getting ready to perform tonight, this yeah. is exciting in your hometown, we're here at downtown Dixon. Yeah, it's exciting. Uh, it's really cool because Tracy and Chuck, those guys come out to join us, show their support. Uh, it's just, you know, it's a great opportunity for us to do something for the community, and I think it's imperative that we do. The Red Towel has found Tracy Lawrence yet again. What's up, Tracy? It's great to see you, Nikki D. How are you? Thank you. I'm good. How did the ride go today? I had a great time today. Uh, I didn't do too much damage to the uh, to the quad. Um, I hit a couple of trees, maybe you rip. Did? Oh yeah, I only know two speeds. Dead still and wide open. <laughs> so I was following one of the one of the guys on a on a dirt bike, and they, he was moving pretty quick. So I, I was able to hang with him pretty well. But I did bang it up a little bit because I'm I'm kind of half crazy anyway. <laughs> yeah. 
Have you ever ridden before, though? Oh, yeah, yeah oh, I, I ride okay. all the time. I've got four wheelers and all that stuff. Oh, Grip riding bikes and stuff. So, yeah. Well, tell me, what brings you out tonight? I mean, Craig is a good friend of mine, and uh, we've helped each other with different charity events over the years. And I know this is something that's very dear to his heart, and I'm always uh, proud to come help a friend out with what they believe in. Yeah. yeah. Hanging out on the red towel with Mr. Chuck Wicks. Welcome to the towel. The red towel. Is it low budget? It's yeah. low budget around here. It's fine. You can take it anywhere, though. That's the thing, right? That's true. And you can dry off in case you know jump in a pool or you're sweaty. You can. Or get dirty from riding bikes and ATVs. Did yeah. You uh, change? <laughs> I am the only person I feel like here that did not change clothes from earlier. Look at Chuck, looking all nice. I, changed, I showered. I knew I was going to be in public, so I showered. Whatever. Actually, no. You know who hasn't changed? Our head honcho, who has, for Pete's sake freaking dirt all along her jeans. Look at that. That is oh. <laughs> some messed up stuff. Is this? Uh, it's fine. I'm okay with it. It's okay. Yeah, I mean, you were at a dirt bike event. Yeah. So it makes sense. I mean, Nashville's kind of far away, so couldn't go home and change. It make Whatever. Sense. It's an outdoor con It's an outdoor concert. Back to business, of course. Yes. Talk about being a part of today. Uh, it's awesome. I've known Craig for years. Uh, we're hunting buddies. We've been friends forever, I think, and uh, when he asked me to be a part of this, um, you do anything for your friends, and when I found out even cooler that he's from Dixon and, and a lot of the proceeds is going and going to stay right here in the town is, uh, I love charity events like that because you get to see where all the money that you raised goes, and you get to see it firsthand, so uh, it's a great event. I, I uh, rode this morning. I'm not much of a rider, but you were in an ATV, right? Yeah. Because he couldn't handle the bike, I'm guessing, is the situation. No, it's because it's what they gave me. <laughs> so if they would have given me a bike, can I would. Can you ride? Yeah, I can ride. Okay. I just don't ride all the time. I'm no Craig Morgan. Okay. I mean, he is a daredevil. That's what we talked about earlier. For the record, Tracy Lawrence was also in an ATV. So. He made it sound like he was on a bike. We just talked. No judgment, though, because ATVs are still cool, so that's awesome. It's harder to fit through the curves. Exactly. So you have to be a better driver. There you go. Since 8 o'clock, it's almost 4 a.m. I don't know when the hurting stops. I'll be a better man and better off. If the love comes my way, we'll be walking in the meadow in the early spring. You've been twirling in a sundress wearing my ring. 